Hey, it's Joe Hashi from Synergy-Athletics.com. Back after about six weeks. Uh, my son was born five weeks ago. Things have been very busy. I'm going to start with one of the mandatory core exercises. And the core exercises are bracing, rotating, or shortening the core. And this is one of the few exercises that, that force you to brace against, against lengthening the core. And that's the ab rollout. You see a lot of gimmicky ab equipment. This isn't one of them. You can buy one of these little wheels at Walmart for, I don't know, six, seven dollars. You can make your own, you can buy fancier ones, you can put a, weights on the end of a barbell and do a roll up, but you have to do it right. So in this video, I'm gonna explain how to do it right, then I'm gonna get a skinny guy to show you some different variations for the next video. Here's what you'll see. People grab the wheel and they'll do this. The problem is you're putting a lot of pressure on your lumbar spine. You need to take your abs, crunch them, hold them tight. Hold your back flat and don't let your lower back sag. Only go out as far as you can hold that position. So instead of here, shorten your abs, hold them tight, roll out as far as you can, pull it back. It might only be a few inches. Once you get better, hold it tight, roll out, pull it back. Don't let your back sag. That is the key point to doing this exercise. This. The next day, like, oh, I did that exercise that Joe guy told me on YouTube. My back's killing me, my abs are sore. Make sure you do it right. Pull. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And I'm going to show you some more difficult variations. I know a lot of you guys and girls out there already have this basic stuff down. But try that. Hit four sets of 12 at the end of a workout, and you'll really be feeling it. Thanks for watching. Hey, it's Joe Hashi from Synergy-Athletics.com. Back after about six weeks. Uh, my son was born five weeks ago. 